Now, some say the recent terror attacks have really fueled hate and even divisiveness. Now, a group of women right here in Cincinnati is hoping to spread a message of unity to sort of strengthen our community. Dan Griffin joining us now with this prayer service that's been happening along Fountain Square, and it encourages people to really stand together. Yeah, and there's no doubt that terrorist attacks have really changed the climate of communities across the nation. Now, no matter their faith, the women who led the prayer service at Fountain Square say the best way to defeat the worst of the world is to be united in peace. As evil forces bring darker times upon us, we can choose the isolation of fear it brings or the mercy of God. Words of solidarity, love, and faith. Messages these women hope will bring people together. We are all welcome here to practice our faith. Amen and amen. Amen. Meaningful and powerful to stand with my sisters of all religions and to stand against hate and to share the understanding that we're all created in the image of God. These women are Christian, Muslim, Jewish, you name it. They're joining voices to show unity in the face of terrorist organizations like ISIS and Al Qaeda. All these people that are here today are here for one thing, and that's peace. Riz Raja says she's standing on the side of love. She's Muslim born and living the American dream. Raja says there's growing hate because of terrorism, making it important to reach out to those you don't know. Get to know them. Learn about people, who they are, their characters. She hopes these events mean future generations band together for the common good. It doesn't matter if a Muslim child or a Christian or a Hindu or a Jew, you know, you go get it, you know, and nothing should hold them back. For people in this crowd, this is about empowering our community to be better, safer, and more connected. Their way of conquering hate in a world filled with senseless violence. We are a land of many colors, and we are singing. You know, one of the supporters told me she's grateful to live here where she feels safe and accepted. She also says it's important to rise above religion, seeing everyone as just Americans or even just people. Sheree. All right, Dan, great story there. Nice positive story for us on this Wednesday. Organizers also say they hope to inspire more of these services and spread more of a positive message.